Hi, welcome back to Burning River Bushcraft. Today we're going to be building a skin-on frame canoe. So I've been looking recently for a solo canoe. I want something that's lightweight that I can carry easily, car top it, get in the water, get it out of the water, but I want something also that's affordable. That's the kicker. I have been completely unable to find a solo canoe, first off, that's affordable. Second of all, one that's in the weight range that I'm looking for. Because I like to get outdoors with equipment that I've made myself, I was kind of drawn to the skin on frame canoes and the skin on frame kayaks. So I did start looking into that and I found one company that advertised working with commercial lumber. That saves me driving to a sawmill, collecting green wood, uh, other species that are more difficult to find. This canoe that I'm building is using strictly common lumber from Home Depot or Lowe's. After a few phone calls with Larry from Geodesic Aerolite, we picked out the perfect boat for me. With my size, I wanted a solo Nesmic style canoe. However, Nesmic was probably like 135 pounds. So uh, I am not quite 135 pounds. So the canoe design that I chose is actually not on a print. So we're gonna take an existing print for a Nimrod 12 and we're gonna stretch that out to 13 feet. So I'm into this project about a week so far, but that has not been steady. I've been working on other projects and I'll jump into and jump out of this project as time permits. I've got my strong back built already. I built a large enough strong back for a tandem canoe if I choose to go that route later. Uh, as well as cutting out all my forms, cutting out all my stringers and uh, my stems. Everything but the ribs is cut right now and ready to go.
So both the stem and the stern have the stringers and the outer gunnel uh, blended and epoxied and they're clamped and dry. So it'll probably be a day or so. And then I'm just gonna come along and trim the ends off and then probably use my rasp and a block plane to go ahead and blend everything in. And